Hello. So I thought we could do a fun unboxing to start our video. It's going to be a packaging upgrades video. Um, so the first thing I have, I'm so excited about this, is Munbin sent me a label printer and it also prints cute stickers. I'm dying. I'm so, so excited. I've been eyeing them for years. When they reached out, I was just like, hell yeah. So we're going to unbox this together and get it set up and print some stickers. This is one of their newer printers. So it's not just wireless, but it's also voice activated. I think they have like a little friend for the studio who's going to talk back to us. Oh, this is really nice. They have an app that helps you design. Oh, it's so pretty. Look at that pink. Cute. I love it. Dun dun dun. Welcome to the Munbin printer. <laughs> Hello? <laughs> Munbin? I'm here. <gasps> they sent me some pink shipping labels, so let's test that out first. Ooh, it's a really cute pink color. Hi, Munbin. I'm here. Take one label. Take one label. Thank you. <laughs> I'm gonna send a test, like, dummy shipping label from the internet that doesn't have anyone's address on it so we can see what it looks like. Looks so good. I love that shade of pink. So they also let me pick out two rolls of little stickers. I'm really freaking excited about If you follow me on here, like watch my other vlogs or follow me on social media, you know I love printing mini labels with label printers. And these are definitely an upgrade. Cha-ching. All right, time to print some mystery bag labels. Those look so cool. Let me show you um, on one of my striped bags. So pretend I packed up mystery bag order. Do do do. Here's your surprise goodies. And then seal it up. Those are good quality. Oh my God. What an upgrade. I love it. I can't wait till someone orders a mystery bag next and we get to pack it up. Oh my gosh. Okay, so the other, I just like hypnotized by it, it's so cool. The other sticker we're gonna make is for Pin Club, which we're not packing now, that's toward the end of the month, but you get a sneak peek at the new sticker for it. They let me pick out another thing of stickers and I got these gradient hearts, which obviously had to. You ready? That looks perfect. Okay, Pin Club is also packed on this striped bag, so let me go grab one. I keep talking about Pin Club, it's my monthly pin subscription. If you're interested, it's at pandaweirdos.com. But yeah, they'll get packed in a bag like this. Same kind of deal. Let's see, oh my god. Oh, these are so cute. Look at these, I can't believe I can make these myself. And there's so many other different ones too. Oh God, I think I have a new addiction coming on. Thank you so much, Monday. It's time to show you some fun packaging stuff. Made myself a little coffee sustenance. Okay, let's just start with the thing that I'm most excited about. Let's cut to the chase. I'm gonna test out water activated paper tape. This is something I've wanted to try for a long time, but to be totally honest, and you may know this if you've looked into it, it is really, freaking expensive <laughs> compared to normal tape but obviously it's nice it's not plastic tape and you get to put your logo on it oh my god it's really wide so we're gonna test this out i also got a dispenser because had to so if i end up liking this you know i'm gonna cover this with a sticker i got this roll on a discount deal just so I could test it and see if I fall in love with it enough to spend the extra on it. It's so cute though. Crap. I've always wondered if it's like sticky on your fingers. So I think that's the main thing that will help me decide. Um, the, oh, those are really on there. Okay, let's, oh, okay. Good thing you're here because it sure feels like I'm talking to myself. <laughs> so how does that go back on? What in the hell? I was looking in the reviews for this product. Someone was like, I was dumb. And I slid the pins all the way off the roller and it was hard to get them back on. I guess you can just leave them on and the tape just goes over them. So if I can get these back on, they will be staying for life. It's good in recording, you know, for health insurance purposes. If I 
injure myself. <laughs> oh wait, this might work. Oh. Oh my god. Da -da -da. I did it. Thank you for coming on that journey. Yeah. I mean, it can still slide off. We'll see if we need to keep that bit on there. I don't know how much. <laughs> Is that good? Let's see if it gets the roller wet. It does. Oh my god. It's happening. Oh, that can go down more. We might have an explosion of water when I push this down. Ooh, that is very full. I know for next time. Okay. Here we go. I'm scared. That should be good. Okay, stick it in my thumb. Oh. Oh, that is noise. And the bit that was sticking to my thumb dried instantly, so it doesn't bother me. I think I have to use the whole roll up to really determine, but that's so cute. <laughs> what the hell? So far, I like it. I'm sure I'll get faster at it too, but that's one of the new packaging things we're gonna be testing. Let me show you another. Another thought on this tape is usually I use two pieces of packing tape. And this is so wide, you only need one. I'm just thinking about like not adding too much time, you know, but I don't think it adds time. I think it'll be more like the sticky wetness does bother me, my fingers, because I can feel it on my fingers. But I would do that for cuteness. I really would. <laughs> so I like that. Okay, let's open this up. We are gonna pack a few orders with this new stuff. Ooh, <laughs> at the end, so I can show you in action. So this is for something else that was sort of bothering me in my packaging process. In my smaller boxes, I was filling empty spaces with purple tissue. And sometimes I didn't really need a full sheet of tissue. So I felt like I was tearing it in weird ways and wasting parts of it sometimes. And it just wasn't right for filling just like a small amount of space in a box or whatever. So in the bigger boxes, they'll still get the tissue, but I got this for the smaller areas. Dun, 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 dun. You're like, oh, Crinkle paper, big whoop. It's not just crinkle paper. It's lilac with holographic. I use white with holographic for pin club and I've never seen this colorway and I instantly was like, oh my God. Can you even see it on video? Let's get a handful. <laughs> it is so cute. So the thing about this is I'm gonna have to see, I have a way I can figure it out, I think. I have to see what the cost is per box to make sure it's not better to just use the, the tissue paper versus this. I'm hoping this is like the same cost or better because uh, it's so much better. Like if I have a box and I just need a little space filled, I can just do a tiny little bit, you know? We'll see how the costing works out. I'll update you on that in the future. But for now, we're gonna pack some orders with this. But I'm gonna show you one more thing. You probably saw it in the last vlog. The other thing that's been working well is the honeycomb paper. Um, I've been using it along with my tissue. Da -da -da. Sometimes there'll be like a sharp edge of a crystal and I'm finding it's coming through the paper, but if I use it in combination with the tissue, it works well. So we're going to pack a few orders and you'll see all of this in action. Okay. So in case you didn't see, I dropped into the shop four new Misfit enamel pins. So they're slightly flawed versions of some past bestsellers. Got the truth is out there. X-Files flip pin with alien proof. And just a little plug, sometimes it's hard to line up a launch with a YouTube video because the YouTube videos are like once a week-ish. So the best way to know when something's live is to go to bandofweirdos.com and sign up for my email list because I send an email when lunches are live. And then I sometimes email like once or twice a month, sometimes I skip a month, but it's a good place to know when there's new stuff on the site. All right, so the first order we're gonna fax for Sherry. She got two of the Truth Is Out There pins. She got one of the Misfit Stay Weird pins and she got a Labradorite crystal pin, an Aura Quartz crystal pin, a Kunzite bracelet, which is my favorite. And she got an Aura Lapidolite bracelet. Love those together. So cute. She got a purple mica tumble. Ooh, I think we're gonna go with that one. Yep. And three Aura Rose Quartz. Whoa. <laughs> Mini spheres. So we gotta pick out our crystal mantra cards. Let's just take a stack over here. Gonna do this for the Aura Lapidolite. 
the purple mica, the kunzite, and the three aura rose quartz babies that'll roll away if I touch them. So first, let's do the honeycomb paper. I'm still figuring out like how much to pull versus when it stretches, how much tissue paper to pair with it. So it's a little awkward right now, but I'm gonna get it down so it's like I can pre-cut strips of both and just grab them. <laughs> but for now, I'm just kind of like measuring as I go. The nice thing about pre-cutting too is I can use a rolling cutter thing with my rolling mat, so it'll be so much faster than this. But we're just testing right now. I haven't done that in like a year. So satisfying. Much more satisfying now that it's pink and not brown. <laughs> my good friend, Cold Brew Barbie, who I mentioned in the last video, she's started using this and that's what swayed me. I was like mesmerized by hers. <laughs> she has order packing videos too, if you're interested. Cold Brew Barbie on YouTube. Okay, got our little spheres. Got our tumble. I'm definitely gonna need to cut some different sizes of this stuff because this is too much cushioning for these little things, but for now it's good. looks good and it's very cushioned and she obviously loves purple so we're gonna go purple organza bag okay we're gonna try this cutie box out so I had picked three orders of different sizes and this is an example of a box size where there's gonna be a lot of empty space in there so we're still gonna use the tissue And we're gonna pick out a free sticker. I think because she got those crystals, we're gonna do, whoops, a crystal sticker. Okay, <laughs> now's the test. Let's just bring this over here. All right, here it goes. Okay, that part's really satisfying where you just lay it down. And it's perfect amount. I like to overlap tape a little bit just to make sure it kind of sticks on itself. Uh, I'm in love with it, so. And any glue that was on my hands is already dry. And at least I can easily do some math to figure out how much tape is used per box. I think it's a hundred foot roll was the test roll. So I can figure out how much it actually costs, but. Oh, I love it. Thank you so much, Sherry. Oh, I don't want to cover the tape. Where should this go? <laughs> I'm spending too long on this. I think that's good. Thank you, Sherry. The next order we're going to pack is for Karen. And thank you so much for your sweet order note, Karen. Really means a lot. She got a Labradorite color changing pin and amethyst pin. This one. And she also got one of the Aura Rose Quartz Mini Spheres. So cute. These are very rolly. Oh my god. <laughs> have to keep an eye on them. They're alive. And a crystal mantra card. Oh, I like that one. Ta-da! Definitely need a pink crystal bag for that. It's so cute. Okay, for this box size, we're gonna get to use the new purple crinkle. It's perfect. <laughs> it helps to keep everything in place without using like a whole tissue sheet, you know? Plus it looks so good. <sighs> Packaging. And she's gonna have to get a crystal sticker too because crystal pins and a crystal. It's paper tape time. What the heck? Huh, hopefully that doesn't happen too often. We'll see. I just feel like she needs this little piece. Yeah, I'm not gonna be doing that every time. Maybe I just didn't use enough force, you know? But that looks very cute too. I think I made it too wide. I think it could just be like this wide because I used to use stickers that were just three inches 
and I held them closed. I don't stick it on the sides because the flaps go down in there so it keeps everything inside but yeah I think next time we'll try like this wide but looking good. Thank you, Karen. This next order is for Julie, and it's gonna fit in an envelope, so it'll be more normal, what we're used to, kind of packaging. Truth is out there, flip pin with proof of aliens. And the two color change pins. Like, I have a little bit of glue on my fingertips, but it's totally dry and it's not getting on anything. So I think that part's gonna be just fine. And for the free sticker, I think I'm just gonna go witch hat because she got she has that crystal ball. I think it matches the vibe. Thank you so much, Julie. Hope you love your order. Okay, that's gonna do it for order packing. I would say so far so good on this. I hope it has a clean cut more often than not, like majority of the time. I think I'm gonna dive into costing for this. So I'm gonna let you go. Thanks for hanging out, but I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye.